When the Steam Deck first arrived, I immediately noticed that fighting games, of all things, were not running smoothly in game mode, whilst most other games seem to be unaffected by this issue. This is rather odd considering Guilty Gear Strive was featured quite prominently on early marketing materials. Could it be due to the scaling filters, or is it the universe's way of testing us mere fighting game purveyance? Well, today, I have the answer and a solution. For those who are short on time, the solution is simply to turn off the frame limiter entirely. Let me explain. Most games will allow your system to run them at the maximum frame rate your system is capable of. For instance, eSports titles like CSGO can easily hit 3 to 400 FPS. Of course, some games offer you the option of capping the frame rate, but there isn't a mandatory limit. Most modern fighting games, however, run at a fixed 60 FPS for reasons beyond the scope of this video. If your system is incapable of running a particular fighting game at 60 frames per second, the game will just chug along in slow motion, rendering it unplayable. On the other hand, even if you have the latest RTX 4090 Ti Extreme OCD 69 edition, the frame rate will still be kept at 60 FPS. Getting back to the Steam Deck, when the device first shipped, the FPS limiter in the game mode maxed out at 60 FPS. When you're playing a game like Street Fighter V, this means that two frame limiters are active at the same time, one from the game and one from the system, causing drop frames and hence the stuttering. Now, following a recent software update, users are now able to uncap the frame rate completely, and lo and behold, buttery smooth gameplay. That said, if you're playing a game without a hard FPS limit, it would probably be better just to leave the slider at 60 FPS because of improved battery life. Other than fighting games, turning off the FPS limiter could also be useful for older titles with weird frame rate caps, like the old PC release of Dark Souls or even retro emulation. I hope you found this short video useful. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. May the algorithm watch over us. Thanks for watching and see you next time.